Hey guys, so it's Monday. I'm just packaging up my Twitter giveaway winner prizes. This was the original, a couple prints and a couple Pokemon cards. I'm just gonna package this up and send it. Package is in the mail. And now it's time for my breakfast slash lunch. So we need to discuss the Beauty and the Beast trailer, okay? They've released the first official trailer for Beauty and the Beast that's not just like a teaser. It's an official trailer. <sighs> It was the first thing I looked at when I woke up this morning because Jacob texted me. He's like, what do you think of the trailer? And I was like, <gasps> and I had to rush and look it up. Overall thoughts, it's amazing. But I will give my opinions on a few specific things. Well, one, I love how detailed everything is. Like anything from props to characters like Cogsworth and Lumiere, they're so, they look so cool, really, really detailed like that. And just things like the pillars and the decorations in the room. I love the look of everything. I feel like it's so aesthetically pleasing and just, <laughs> in terms of having Emma Watson as Belle, I like it. Like if they're gonna go with a well-known actor, I'm glad it's Emma Watson. But I would prefer if it was some nobody I've never heard of because then I could see that person more as Belle because now I'm, I'm gonna see Emma Watson and go, that's Emma Watson. It's gonna be hard to get that out of my head. We've known what Beast design, Beast's design looks like for a while now because they've released a couple posters over the last while and at first I was like well like why are his horns going backwards because actual beast has these little horns coming forward and then the beast in the movie has big horns going backwards so at first I was like Ooh, but you know like it's growing on me it's growing on me <laughs> also in the trailer beast was just so like well-mannered and seemed like such a gentleman but in the original movie, he's like very hot-headed, has a short temper, he's always getting angry, right? And so I hope they include more of that in the movie because, you know, we only saw like a little taste. We can't really say what the movie's gonna be like just from the trailer, but I'm really hoping they have like temper temperamental beast. I just want angry beast, you know? So, yeah. I know some people were complaining in the comments that it just looked like a scene by scene recreation of the animated film. If it was, I honestly wouldn't care, but I don't think it actually is. I think they're just showing those iconic scenes in the trailer to appeal to those original fans. People like me, who when we see these iconic scenes recreated, we're like, oh, like, I don't know, we get all excited for it. I think that's who they're trying to appeal to with this trailer, so. Ah, I'm so excited though like I actually got like really teary-eyed and then started crying when I was watching the trailer Like the first time I watched it I just felt like really emotional at the end and then I rewatched it and I was crying and I watched it like so many times And I feel like I'm gonna watch it so many times in theaters too. Like it's gonna be so good ah, I'm excited ah, Look at the lights behind them and ah, ah, I can't also I need this cloak in my life so the mailman just came. Most of the stuff was for Christian, his beard stuff. And then this has gotta be a sword or something like it. So, uh, typical Christian. And I got something. I actually got a couple things. One was a check, so that was nice. This one looks a bit scarier. From Volkswagen, important safety recall notice. Oh gosh. Suction pump. Your vehicle is affected by the safety recall described in this letter. However, due to the limited parts supply, your dealer may not be able to perform the recall work for you at this time. In the interim, if you have any concerns about driving your vehicle or if you smell fuel in the vehicle, make an appointment with your authorized Volkswagen dealer to have the vehicle inspected slash repaired without delay. Leaking fuel in the presence of an ignition source could lead to a fire causing injury and or damage to property. I actually already have an appointment to get my car serviced next week just for like oil change and checkup and that kind of thing so I'll bring this letter and they probably won't have time to do anything about it that day but maybe they will or maybe they'll schedule me in for another day so I'll bring this when I go to my appointment. So I'm gonna head out and see if I can get my hands on a copy of the Beauty and the Beast cover of Entertainment Weekly because when that was first announced it wasn't actually on shelves yet in stores and so it should be out now. It came out on the 11th, so I'm kind of a little bit late on this, so hopefully there's still some in stock. So that's my mission, to go find the Beauty and the Beast cover of Entertainment Weekly. They only have the Walking Dead one, and I'm checking over here too. That's the only place they keep that magazine. So they didn't even put out the Beauty and the Beast ones yet. Ah. 
So I brought one of the magazines up front to the cashiers and asked if they had this week's issue and they said I was the third person to ask today and that they don't have it but they have a whole pallet of magazines in the back that are supposed to go out on a Wednesday and it's in there. So like they have them in the back but they can't put them out till Wednesday which is dumb because that issue was from Friday and they're not putting it out until Wednesday so I'm like ugh. Fine. I don't know anywhere else that sells them. I've checked a few places in the past, so I'll just have to wait. Okay, this Moana stuff is so cute. I stopped by Toys R Us because I wanted to see if they have the Genesect Pokemon cards, but they're like cleared out of all their Pokemon stuff, which really sucks. Moana's so cute. Then there she is with her raft. There's this. Oh, here's just Moana. And <gasps> then a different outfit with Hey Hey. <laughs> These are nowhere as cute as the Disney Store ones. <laughs> the hair. <laughs> I, am one of I actually have this at home right now. I was sent it by the company. 40% off. I want your shoe. So on the way back, I decided to swing by EB Games and they did have one of the Genesect boxes. Usually I buy two of each, but they only had the one and I might just get one Genesect because it's the one I'm least excited about. Like the packs are the same, but I mean, I'm, I'm so close to completing that set that I might just get one of these. But for Meloetta, I'm definitely getting two because Meloetta is so cute. Are you all squished? She's like pushing me. She's like, get out of here, mommy, this is my spot. I was here first. Baby, my bum is getting sore from sitting on the edge of the chair. Don't look at it. I could have sworn one of these nibs was smaller than the other, and I'm comparing them, and I'm right. Look how much smaller one is than the other, and these are both 0.5s. Just that one is the SP and one is the regular one. What are you doing? Anyway, it's just about 1.30. I just finished up my work for today and I want to get to bed so I can get started on work at a good time tomorrow. I just have two work days left and then I'm done this first half of the book. So yay, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. This is pretty packed, there was a wait and somehow I got seated at the exact same table as last time. <laughs> I came here without you. Cooperation is how 